Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Actually, welcome back to the first video in a very long time. But I wanted to start things off really strongly here with the new Paudia collection. Unfortunately, I only got two out of the three. So we have uh, Fukoko and we also have Quaxley as well. So I am uh, definitely keeping an eye out for Sprigatito as well. And hopefully I do find it, but you know, you get a pin for each one as well, definitely really fun. Uh, and you could either get Miraidon or you could get uh, the other one as well. I forgot the name of it, but uh, yeah, that's pretty much your choices. Uh, it's been a while since I last opened any packs whatsoever because I've just uh, been so busy uh, throughout pretty much over a year now since I last uploaded, right? So with that being said, haven't been fully keeping up to date with uh, any card games whatsoever. Just uh, really busy. So uh, it's going to be fun again to get back into this and I do intend to make more videos. So do stay tuned for that. But for now, we are going to be starting things off with this particular opening. We are going to open up both of these. And uh, yeah, it's just going to be really exciting to see what we actually get. So yeah. Yeah, I've kind of slowly managed to get myself back into a little bit more time to actually uh, get into card games again. So with that being said, I'm going to slowly uh, phase back into all this and I'm going to start uploading videos again. So yeah, I hope you guys are all excited about that. Uh, definitely something for you to stay tuned for. Uh, it's also partially my... Uh, New Year's resolution as well since it's now 2023 uh, the entire goal of this was to essentially just get back into YouTube you know so uh, yeah it's been such a long time and I would definitely uh, you know really want to get back into this so here we are we have our cards and looks like we have a code card as well so, sorry, let me just get all of this out here. Set that aside. And uh, this is the code card for you guys. So, hope you'll enjoy that. Uh, but with that being said, we have our Miraidon EX. Uh, very interesting to see that, but it's a nice jumbo card. So, we can always put that in our jumbo binder. Uh, and we have our packs as well. We have uh, our Silver Tempest, our Brilliant Stars. Uh, another Silver Tempest and another Brilliant Stars. So it's definitely going to be really fun to open up as well. Uh, and lastly, we do have our pin. Very exciting of Fukoko. Uh, so definitely very nice. That is crazy that you actually have like two of these here, but uh, yeah, that's going to be really fun to open up. So we'll set that aside for the time being. Uh, we have our promos. So we have our Fukoko, we have our Quaxley, and we have Sprigatito. Very interesting the way they do the borders. It's now almost like a mirror effect to it. Uh, very shiny. I don't know how I feel about it just yet. If these cards are at least legal to play, then that's fine. But uh, yeah, it's going to be very interesting to see uh, what I'll do with these. Uh, obviously, it's just nice to have them as collection anyway. But I'll set them aside for now. Uh, this has been quite a popular set uh, right off the get-go. As I said at the beginning of the video, I was trying my best to actually look for a Sprigatito, uh, but I couldn't find it. So let's open up the next one as well, and then we'll open up the packs all together. So I'll probably speed up this part. Alrighty, so this is what we have in the Quaxley box. Uh, again, two Silver Tempests and two Brilliant Stars. Uh, here is our Quaxley pin. Very nice here. Again, just a uh, little bit focus for the sec. And yeah, it's really interesting that we have two pins in one. Uh, so that's definitely a really interesting way of doing it. It's less likely to get lost, so I think that's just uh, uh, Pokemon taking in consideration of people actually losing their pins, you know, and having them just uh, pulled out. So yeah, to actually have two, it makes it more secure. Uh, I like to always just uh, put these on uh, backpacks, everything like that, or lanyards. So yeah, it's going to be really fun to actually display these. Uh, but with that being said, 
with our packs. This is for Quaxley's side, and this over here is for Fukoko's side. So we are going to pretty much uh, compare and see which box produces better pulls. Uh, we have our two promos, happens to be the same one. Of course, it's one out of the two alternate ones you can actually get. But we'll set that aside for now. And uh, as for these, uh, we do actually get different artwork, which is very interesting for the promos, you know, so I like it. But uh, you can see that it is also randomized as well. We have the Sprigatito being the two same artwork here, but the Quaxley is definitely very different, uh, as you can see. And Fukoko is also very different as well. So. It's going to be fun, you could actually just buy a bunch of these and you would have no idea whatsoever what you are actually getting. So with that being said, uh, let's set everything to their sides and let's get all of these opened up and uh, see how we go, yeah? So let's start here on the Fukoko side with a Silver Tempest pack. And let's find out how we go in the first pack so here is the code card for you guys and we are going to put four and continue on there so here is our energy we have Dedene very nice uh, quad stone more Pekka uh, Marini we have Mistravis Swablu Swellix we have Rotom and uh, Marini as well as a clink clang so nothing particular specially uh, to begin with there, but let's see what we have on the Quaxley side. A Silver Tempest again. Alrighty, so let's get that opened up. And here's the code card for you guys. Enjoy. We have here four to the top. And let's find out what we have in this one. Uh, Araquanid, Stone Journal, Rots, we have Durant, Fletchling, Dratini, Clink, we have Dedene in a hollow, and we have Mylotic, so nothing particularly special yet, uh, but let's move on to Brilliant Stars and let's see how we go here in the uh, Fukuoka side again. Alrighty, so let me get this opened up. And here's the code card for you guys, hope you enjoy that. And take four to the top, and let's see what we have in this particular one. We have Grottle, uh, Primplup, Monferno, uh, Chimcho, uh, Gibble, Turtwig, we have Trapinch, we have uh, Piplup, we have here yeah, Double Turbo Energy, very nice here yeah, as a reverse holo, and uh, Professor's Research, it is a holo, so I'll definitely take that. Definitely very nice. This is uh, Professor Rowan. Uh, so always a very nice card to get Professor's Research. It is uh, quite a staple in games. But we have over here another Brilliant Stars. This one here is Arceus. So very excited to actually see what we have in this particular pack. And here we have our code card for you guys. And let's see what we have in this particular pack. So, we have Water Energy, Ace Rollers, Premonition, Pot Helmet, we have Executor, Horlucha, we have Buzzle, we have Gibble, Trapinch, Cast Form, oh my goodness, wow, that is insane. We have here a VMAX uh, Rapid Strike Urshifu, I like this, I love the alternate artwork, that is awesome. It's all gold, it's... It's not even alternate artwork, it's the same artwork as the Shifu, it's just all in gold, so I love that. The black and gold uh, brings out really nice contrast, and you see the slight blue to obviously signify the rapid strike as well. Uh, yeah, definitely fantastic. I believe it is the same attack as the uh, original one as well from uh, Battle Styles, so definitely going to be great to add to my deck as an alternate form of the card. And we also have here a Honchcrow V. Wow, that is amazing. Uh, wow, that, that's a great pack. That's a fantastic pack. i uh, got to say, though, the bordering is definitely not great. The uh, quality control here is not amazing. But even so, I am happy with a V card. I am happy with the Urshifu V Max. This was a great pack already. So yeah, a few plus points on the uh, Quaxley side of things. But let's move back to uh, Fukoko's side. We have here another Silver Tempest. Let's find out what we actually have in this particular pack. So inside, let's open this up. 
And here's the code card for you guys. Hope you enjoy that. And we take the four, put it in the top, and let's see what we have in this particular one. Raichu, very nice. Honch Crow, Fanfi, Phoebus, we have Dratini, we have Wailmar, Clink, uh, Patilil. Uh, in reverse holo and we have Fion or Fion um, as our regular rare so nothing special in that one again but let's move on to Silver Tempest in our Quaxley side and and that's what we have in this particular one so here is the code card for you guys so I hope you enjoy that and top four cards to the bottom let's find out what we have in this so, Matang, Toxapex, Lance, we have Patello, Pikachu, we have Growlithe, Clink, Wailma, Sunflora, and uh, Archops? Archiops or something? I mean, it's nice, it's interesting. But this one is just a regular holo. I mean, even so, it's really nice anyway. Uh, we have two brilliant star packs left, and they both have to be. Uh, Charizard as well, uh, though this one actually does look like a slightly different one than this, I'm not too sure, but uh, yeah, with that being said, let's find out how we actually go with this particular one, so let's start off again on Fukoko's side, and let's see how we actually go with this particular one, alrighty, we'll pry it open, and wow, the code cards are just right there, very interesting. And top four cards to the bottom. Let's find out how we actually go in this particular one. Oh, Ultra Ball, fantastic reprint. Can't wait to actually play it. I think we've had we've had a great ball, we've had quick ball, but to actually have Ultra Ball come back, that is fantastic. Absolutely excited about this as well. So the format is going to be really fun to play. But uh, we have Sork, we have Cherubi, Clefairy, Carablast, Staryu, Ryolu as our reverse, and we have a Trudigon. So nothing particularly special with the Coco side of things. That's unfortunate, but you know what? I'm already so happy just to get the pin. I'm happy to get the promos. I mean, there's really not much else to complain. I'm just excited to get back into the game again. It's been such a long time, so this is all just... Uh, absolute nostalgia even though it's just been a year ago uh, but yeah let's open up the final pack of brilliant stars here on Quaxley side and let's find out what we actually get in this particular one so we have over here the code for you guys and the top four cards to the top let's find out what we have in this all right Sharon's care we have here Bearctic, Collapse Stadium, Sneasel, Bidoof Electabuzz, we have Chimcho, we have Gibble, we have here a Reverse Hollow Warmadarm, and we have, oh, look at that. I think this is the first V-Star I actually have. This is Whimsicott V-Star. I've never pulled a V-Star before. So, yeah, this is my very first V-Star card that I own. Very nice. I mean, that's a great start. Uh, again, quality control could improve because you can see the border is a bit offset here. But you know, what can you expect from, uh, you know, from Pokemon? Uh, yeah, it doesn't matter. It's just still a really amazing card to actually get here. So, really happy about that. Uh, the major highlights being the Whimsy Cod, of course. But we also, of course, have the Oshifu V Max and the Honchro V, which actually both came in the same pack. So, uh, Quaxley's side of things actually was really amazing. Absolutely, really happy about this. Yeah, I hope you guys actually enjoyed this particular opening. I mean, this was unexpected. This was really just meant to be a catch up video, uh, kind of just explaining where I was. But there will be more to come so definitely stay tuned guys i will be making more videos again i'm just very excited to get back into the card game so with that being said have a great day i'll see you all next time